to do more about the uh, illegal sales uh, to minors. I think this is an important uh, first step, though, and we will take uh, others that are necessary. Uh, Morgan Lesko, followed by Kathleen Shee in the White Oak Middle School group. Morgan, you're on. Thank you for letting me speak. My name is Morgan Lesko, and I'm nine. This is my brother, Max, and he is six. We live at 3909 Prospect Street in Kensington. Last Friday, we went to Big Boys for dinner. There we saw a vending machine. I wasn't sure what to do, so I thought about kids who really wanted to smoke and how they would buy cigarettes. Each time someone came near us, we pretended to look outside at the cars. When I finally got all the quarters in, Max pulled the handle. At least 10 people were around, and they didn't say anything. Then our mom came over and took a picture of us in front of the vending machine. That night, we went to the bowling alley, and there was another vending machine. It was wide in the open. I was very scared, but what Max wasn't. He put the, <laughs> he put the quarters in, but they got jammed. Then we went up to this kid named Jeff, to, who is a ninth grader at Walter Johnson High School. I knew him from basketball. We told him what we were trying to do about getting rid of vending machines. He thought it was a great idea. Then we asked him if he would help us by buying cigarettes. He said, sure, and he did it perfectly. He just went up. Jeez. He just went right up to the machine with his back to about 20 people, but no one cared. That night, Max and I learned how to get the cigarettes easily. The next day, we went shopping at Giant. This time, the machine was right next to the candy and toy vending machines. Max and I knew exactly what to do. We put the dollar bills in and pushed the buttons and got the cigarettes. Guess what? The store manager was right n near us, and he didn't say a word. Here are the photographs. <laughs> we think we have proved that any kid can j go up to a vending machine and buy cigarettes. We think we should ban s all cigarette vending machines in Montgomery County. Thank you. <laughs> I guarantee some fancy lobbyists in this room tonight. <laughs> but there's not a one of them who's going to touch you guys. Uh, thank you very much for coming and uh, for proving the case for this bill. And I'm sure we will pass this bill. And, and your work has, uh, has helped us be able to do that.